so I freaked out. I uh, connected uh, the quad to base flight to uh, uh, clean. Uh, sorry, clean flight to uh, to uh, to make sure. Uh, oh, actually, what I did was just connected to bind the RX. I have to bind the RX with the CLI line because of uh, because it's a sat and it's not. Anyways, whatever. Anyway, so I connected to the motors to the. Uh, I went to the motors tab just to make sure everything was good to go, and this motor didn't spin at all. And then motor number two, they were just all over the place. They weren't spinning the right way and they're all messed up. So I thought I'd resoldered everything wrong and I uh, was gonna have to uh, go back and resolder everything. So just before I started resoldering, I thought, you know what, I'm going to, uh, so I looked underneath the flight controller and they're all plugged in wrong. And even motor one was actually plugged in upside down. So the signal wire wasn't going to the right pin. So if you guys are ever having trouble in a build, just double connect your connections. I was pretty confident that that my motors were in the right spot because I used little little stickers to uh, to help me with orientation when I was resoldering them back on again. And I thought that somehow I, that I had screwed it up and I was ready to just start removing motors. And anyways, I was pretty frustrated at myself. But it was just a matter that I didn't plug everything in uh, in the right sequence um, sequence. Uh, no. In the right order on the uh, on the uh, ESE pins right in here so uh, so there was just all you know I had them in motor number one and the motor number fourth and whatever and motor number one was even turned upside down so anyway so I just screwed that up so uh, anyways just a matter of replugging everything back in again and no soldering required and I'm, I'm pretty happy so if you guys ever get to the point where things aren't working out on 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 clean flight or whatever uh, software you're using to uh, to 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 check your connections or whatever, and nothing's going right. Just make double check things before you start desoldering everything. And uh, ha had I actually desoldered everything and and put it back to where I thought, then it would have been screwed up when I went to plug in the thing again. So, uh, anyways, I saved myself probably at least a two or a three hour job had I resoldered everything. So, uh, anyways, just. A little note to double check everything that's easy to double check um, before you start doing difficult things so uh, yeah anyways you could save yourself a lot of time anyways uh, there you go thank you